First, let's check more details about the post, Viceroy of India. Viceroy and governors were appointed by the Queen, or the British Crown. And Viceroy was the direct representative of British Crown in India. By the Act, Viceroy of India was to be assisted by an executive council. Lord Canning became the first Viceroy of India. Now let's check more details about the post, Secretary of State for India. He was to be a member of the British Parliament and responsible to the Parliament. This post was the political head of British India, vested with complete authority and control over Indian administration. To assist the Secretary of State for India, the Act established a 15-member Council of India, an advisory body. Secretary of State for India was the chairman of the Council. The Council was capable of suing and being sued in India and in Britain. Indian civil service came under the Secretary of State for India. Lord Stanley, was the first Secretary of State for India.